Se wata ho sa te ne kana sa tagi kari wanata ne aska te wanyawa aska tanu zata FM. Over the years, the uh, station had an initial uh, success and uh, had its ups and downs throughout the years. And finally, in 2017, it went off the air because of a transmitter problem, equipment problem, and there wasn't any resources or means to get that fixed. Most native communities have their radio station and there's many number one reasons but uh, we want to be able to provide uh, programming in our own language and promote Ganyageha and that comes along with our identity and we can talk about our history and our traditions and all this through radio programming. Facebook is not an answer to, uh, or social media, to communicating what's going on in the community. And everybody wants to know what's going on, certainly on a political level, and what the Mohawk Council of Gunasadaga is up to. Right now we're below 50 watts, and that what that means is you're on an unprotected frequency. The biggest step we have to take is get more power. And to get more power, we need to move the site, get a better coverage, a new uh, tower, new antenna. And in doing so, we're, we'll be asking for more power. So fundraising is a big part of getting the radio station back on the air. Reviving Ganasanagi Radio, we've developed through the Eastern Door and Steve Bonspiel, the Secret Door Fundraiser. Now the Secret Door Fundraiser, the way it works is we're selling 100 doors, we're calling them. It's like 100 tickets, or $1,000 each. So the grand prize is $20,000. We have a second prize of $8,000. We have four prizes of $5,000 and another prize of $2,000. Those are the grand prizes. And again, every door wins in this uh, contest. And we have a Facebook page. So you look up the secret door on a You got all the information there. The latest numbers that are available to buy are there. And it's uh, constantly updated. So get your secret door and help the fundraiser here in Ganasadagi to help get Ganasadagi Radio back on the air. Mm -hmm.